Hi, in today's tutorial I'm going to quickly walk you through hooking up your Cricut to your computer with a focus on how to connect it to Bluetooth. Our next step is to go to www.cricket.com forward slash setup. And we select the product type we're setting up, which is a cutting machine. And I'm setting up a maker, but if you're setting up something different, go ahead and select that. And here it says you either download Cricut, which I already have on my computer, um, or you can open the app. So I agree to their terms, select that. And then if you don't have Cricut, download now, and they'll ask you to sign up. But I do have it, so I'm going to open the app. And it wants me to clear 10 inches of space behind my Maker 3, which I've done wants me to plug it in and power it on, which we've already done. And this is where it gets a little confusing if you want to use Bluetooth, because step three asks you to plug the USB cord and connect it via the cord. I don't want to do that, mainly because my cord doesn't reach, so I want to connect via Bluetooth, but they don't give you an option and walk you through connecting via Bluetooth, so I'm going to go ahead and do that for you. And you can go ahead and either X out of this, we can come back in later, or you can minimize it. Because what we're gonna do now first is we're gonna make sure that your computer is set up to handle Bluetooth. So you do that by going into your start menu and you type in device manager. And then when your device manager comes up, if you see Bluetooth right here, then you're good to go. So go ahead and close that. If you don't see Bluetooth there, you can always purchase a Bluetooth adapter which can slide into your computer and allow your computer to be Bluetooth compatible. So now that I know that I have Bluetooth, so I want to go to settings and I want to come over here to Bluetooth and devices. I want to come in here to devices and add a device. And I want to select Bluetooth. And these are all the things near me that have Bluetooth. And right here is my Maker 3. So I wanna connect that. And there you go, it's connected. They did say sometimes it'll ask for a pin. If it does that on your computer, the pin is four digits and it's zero, 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 zero. So I'm going to quickly go back through the setup process. So now I'm back to step three and it still doesn't say connect via Bluetooth even though we just did. But what you do is you scroll down here and in this drop down, you have the option to select your Bluetooth connection. And I'm going to continue and it's updating, which is a good sign. Perfect, it's updated, it's activated, it's set up. And then next they allow you to register your machine. It's quick and easy. I recommend doing it. It just takes a second. Congratulations, your Cricut is set up and connected via Bluetooth and you are ready to make your first test cut.